Hello everybody. In this video I would like to show you how you can import audio recordings from the uh, native iOS app Mimo or Voice Recorder to your iMovie audio track. And uh, you can usually do a voice over here, but if you have to do some research during the recording, let's say on a website, uh, it's not possible, so it will it, it uh, will stop the recording. You can't do audio recording, or you have a recorded track from from uh, two hours before you start editing the video, and you have to link the audio file to this project. So you can now open the voice recorder, and as you may know, uh, if the voice recorder is recording, then you can leave the app, and you see the red bar on top. And this shows you it's recording, it's still recording. So you can now do anything and record your voice or anything you want to record. And um, then you have to save this recording. So we name it test. Here we have it, it's a test.m4a. And if you now tap to the file, you can edit it out, go to message uh, via Threema, you can uh, Uploaded it to Dropbox or uh, Google Drive, and we will do the upload uh, to Google Drive now. And as you may know, in uh, iMovie, you can choose the cloud services, the iCloud services from Apple or from Dropbox or from uh, Google Drive or whatever uh, cloud drive you have. And here in the audio section, we cannot access to this file now, so we have to go back and scroll down to the uh, cloud drive and then we go to locations and then we can switch to Google Drive to the account and I will do a refresh now and we scroll down just if we see yeah here we are test M4A and what's this you can't you can't select it so what next well, just go to the uh, Mimo, to the voice recorder app and just cho choose this export button and then go to mail and then you can send yourself uh, a mail with this uh, test.m4a audio file. Just type in my email address and yep, here we go. Now let's switch to the mail app. And as we can see, we have new email. And when you open the email, you see there's this test.m4a long tab on the file. And then you have uh, you can choose uh, many, many different options. And uh, here you can see, ah, copy to iMovie. OK, let's uh, pick this. And iMovie will open now iMovie will ask you what to do next, so you can create a new movie, the first selection, and you can link it to the, the last project you've edited. So, here we go, here's the audio track, and yeah, it's in your iMovie now. So, that's it, I hope uh, this helps, and uh, yeah, sorry for my bad English, but uh, I hope... Uh,